When the game is installed and ready to run, the blue button named Install or Update changes to red named Start Game. Every time we log in, we must agree to the terms of service. After that we select the server we want to play. Next time you log in, it will have selected your last choice. The game has three versions. Live is the up-to-date current version in terms of story, skills, and quests. Kronos and Naya are two servers set at different time zones. Time zones are important, choose the one closer to you, otherwise you may miss time-restricted events. Classic is an old configuration of the server, story, skills and quest are different, it is supposed to be the hardest one. It also has two time zones. Aiden is a simplified version focused on solo playing, every class can progress alone, even tanks and healers. It has no story to follow and quests are as simple as go to that place and hunt this many monsters. There are three servers available, Blackbird and Elcadia are different time zones, but Guardian has a PvP schedule only allowed on weekends. Lineage 2 has no factions, instead it has a complex PvP system that involves clan wars and killing non-enemies incurring a penalty. This will be explained in future videos. After selecting server version and time zone, you reach the character selection screen. We can create a maximum of 7 characters by account and by server. So you can create 7 characters in each server with the same account. Before you go nuts and try it, I have to tell you that deleting a character takes 30 days. Click create and let's explore character creation options. There are 7 races to choose from. Human. Elf. Dark Elf. Orc. Dwarf. Sylph. And Camiel. From each race you can choose gender. Male or female. And lastly you can choose class type. Warrior or wizard. Warriors use physical skills and simple attacks with weapons like sword, blunt, spear, etc. Wizards use spells, simple physical attacks with their magic sword or staff deal very low damage. There are three classes outside warrior and wizard that are restricted by a combination of race and gender. Vanguard can only be a male orc, Death Knight can be selected by male human, male elf and male dark elf. Finally, Assassin can be male human or female dark elf. Character customization is extremely limited to three facial expressions, a few hairstyles and four hair colors. I am going to play the server Aiden because there, I won't need a party with tank, healer and buffer in order to progress. I am also going to create a character with a class that uses light armor. At level 60 I will be able to choose Nightmare Gloves and Boots Light, they have a bonus that absorbs 2% of damage dealt to monsters as health points. Robe and Heavy Sets don't have that bonus, but if I don't like that class, I can create another one like a Heavy Armor user and transfer the gloves and boots to it. I will play a Race Camiel class Soul Hound. This class is a hybrid wizard with physical skills and a sword that can deal some damage when mana runs low. It also requires less books to learn the good skills, books are hard to get and some classes require a bunch of them. Unfortunately there is no option to auto-generate names, so I have to try them until I find one not taken. Alright. I have my new character ready for adventures, thank you for watching, see you in Aiden.